the nation, there's a divide between police departments and the community members. Well, today here at Wisner Park, the family of Gary Strobridge is asking Elmira Police Department to take responsibility for the death of their son. Such an injustice has been done to them. It's nearly a year since their son passed away. They've had no answers. The officers have not been accountable. A call for action today in downtown Elmira as family and friends gather for answers. We spoke to one protester who wants to remain off camera but says the family needs closure. The local police department has not uh, said to the community here were the officers that were involved. The mother of Gary says even though her son is gone, it's still up to the police to resolve his death. It's up to the police department to take care of that situation. And the mayor as well. Those a part of the protest relive the sight of Gary after he was sent to the hospital in unrecognizable. He was up in Syracuse at the hospital, black and blue swollen and on life support to the point where his parents, Mr. and Mrs. Strobridge, went up to see him and they had to go back to the nurse's station to find out if they had the right room. And yes, and I couldn't believe the pictures on Facebook of them. All in all, the community is standing behind the Strobridge family as they ask the officers involved in the incident to come forward and relieve the family of their pain. In downtown Elmira, Ed Wisner,